I'm running a YouTube channel. I'm live streaming. I have multiple companies and I have a full-time day job. I also look like the fucking Hulk. How do I do that? What is the secrets for being a hyper productive software engineer? Actually, to be honest, how to be successful in life. That's what I'm going to talk about. I'm going to tell you how I do things, how I schedule my day and how I basically organize my life and be successful. You know what I mean? But before we start, guys, I need to show you something. Um, like I said, I'm going to focus a shit ton on my Patreon page, which is basically uh, the private community for every software engineer that wants to be successfully productive in the space, especially uh, with the main focus on the goal and distributed systems and of course, backend systems, right? So I have a shit ton of videos here. Uh, I'm basically revamping it a little bit. I'm also going to do one-on-one -on -one mentorships, group mentorships, uh, and all that stuff. Check out this page if you want to see how I build things, especially the new real-time database, which is called Hopper, uh, which is a direct competitor to Superbase Pocketbase and all these other things. Um, I'm building this specifically, exclusively on my Patreon page. Check it out. And for the people, of course, that really like my videos, consider subscribing to my channel. Give me a thumbs up, leave some questions in the comments and jump into my Discord community. All the links are down below. All right, so let's get this thing started. The secrets of being a hyper productive software engineer. I get this question a lot and I think I need to make a video about it. Today is the day. So <clears throat> the most important thing, guys, is what you need to understand is you need to detect and it's actually the most important thing. You need to detect the times, the time slot where you are going to be the most productive, the most hyper focused in during the day. In my case, that's going to be. Uh, let me quickly see. Am I yes? I'm the home on the home row. So when I'm the most productive, the first question you need to ask: When am uh, I the most productive? Uh, yeah. Right. In my opinion, well, in my in my case, that's going to be um, the first three to four hours in the morning, right? And that's important. You need to protect that time slot at all costs. You need to protect it with your life. And what do I mean by that? You are going to turn off your cell phone. You are going to turn off Slack. Discord, right? Uh, also very important, no meetings and no secondary tasks, right? This time slot, for me, it's in the morning. It could be in the night for you or in, uh, during, the, uh, during midday. It doesn't really actually matter. You're going to protect that and you're going to do hyper-focused work. No PR reviews. No small issues to fix. You're going to focus on big chunks of features, high productive work, deep focus, right? Also very important, no vocal music. But that's also a little bit of a personal preference, right? Because vocal music is going to distract you with all these vocals, right? Na na na, and then you're gonna you're gonna get these lyrics inside of your head, and you maybe gonna dwell away from the focus. So I'm using like, um, what playlist I'm actually using is this one. I have a playlist on right now. You can hear it because I plugged the desktop audio. For example, these uh, chill progressive half trends uh, or the resonation, it's also very nice. Uh, I will link this on my Discord so you can basically have the same thing. These two playlists are my main to go. They are, um, yeah, no, non-vocal trance house-ish music uh, to, keep you, to keep you going. You know what I mean? That's that. So that's the first three to four hours in the morning. It can be three hours, it can be four hours, it can be two hours and a half. As long as you're focused, it's the most important thing because in these blocks, if you, if you organize this very well, in that specific block, you can get more stuff done than somebody that works eight hours straight at a desk, at a, at a, at a company or something. And I swear to God, this is so fucking true, right? You just need to protect that block and do what the fuck you need to do. And everything else doesn't exist, right? Okay, cool. Then, basically, very important. After that, our brain is mentally drained, right? People don't under understand that, especially uh, CTOs and, and, and uh, CEOs, did, uh, company HR, they don't understand it, that engineering is a very, very mentally draining task. After such a block, I'm completely fried. I'm gassed out. Right? 
that's very important. So we are not going to basically jump from three to four hours into something secondary tasks. No, we're going to jump from that focused block into nothing, right? So what I'm doing then is basically eating, right? I'm eating plus gym all the fucking time. Seven out of seven. There is no, there is no exception. This is, this is how it's going to be. It's, it's predetermined. It's written in the stars. This is exactly how it's going to go each and every single day. It's very important. Be consistent. Uh, be a little bit mentally ill. Like, how do you say that? Autism, right? A little bit autism. Autistic, how do you say that? Um, you have your structure, your day, and, and nothing can come in between. Eating gym. How long does it take? Well, it's going to take, I think, two hours. Uh, something like that. Plus, plus minus two hours, right? After that... I'm going to do secondary tasks, right? Secondary, uh, secondary tasks, right? What are secondary tasks? Well, actually, to be honest, uh, that's that. Two is this one. I don't know what's, what the title is going to be. Um, then three, secondary tasks, right? What are secondary tasks? Emails, uh, maybe a meeting. I, I'm not a big fan of meetings, but sometimes they need to happen, right? Uh, for example, DMs. Reply to DMs, that's what I'm going to do. A reply to DMs. Um, maybe some PR reviews in your case. I don't know, PR reviews. Um, maybe minor issues, something like that, right? Minor issue, bug fixes maybe, bug fixes. Something like that, right? When that, How long is it going to take this one? Most of the time, one hour or maybe ish. One hour ish, right? Something like that. Ish. Boom. After these secondary tasks, I'm going to pick up my kids from school. Kids from school, right? Uh, that's going to be well, but, uh, some entertainment. Maybe you don't have kids. Perfectly fine. You're going to do something else. It doesn't actually matter. You're going to cook food. You're going to uh, read a book, watch, whatever. Sit in your hangmat or something. I don't know. In the jacuzzi, go to the swimming pool. It doesn't really matter. You're just going to do nothing, right? Um, because this is basically the entrance to the uh, evening f eat food. I, I, basically, my, my English voc vocabulary is it's garbage. I know. Uh, that's what it actually, uh, yeah, fine. So what I'm going to do here is basically uh, I'm going to make some food actually here. Food, homework for these kids, uh, playing around, uh, all that stuff. Maybe cleaning the house or something. You know what it is. It's like um, the normal, the normal, the normal man, the normal human behavior, right? That's what I'm going to do. How long is it going to take this? Well, maybe three hours, right? Three hours like that. And guys, again, this is every day, right? This is, there is no, no exception. It's good. That's how it is every fucking day, right? So that's nice. Uh, then basically at five, we are entering what I'm calling the next potential stage of deep focused work. In my case, right? When does it happen? The kids are in bed. Everybody is watching TV. Everybody is watching Netflix. Everybody is tired of their eight hour workday. Nobody is going to basically bothering you. It's basically the night time before to sleep time, right? And that's where I'm basically going to have a sec um, another block of deep focused work, right? How long is that going to take? That's not going to take four hours or three hours. Most of the time, in my case, it's going to be two hours, two to three hours, right? And that's going to be focused Again, focus work. Is it going to be the same thing like your, in my opinion, in my case, the, the morning routine? No, it's not going to be as effective. But it's going to be more effective than during this day. Because during the day, guys, everything can happen. People can come to you. People can, you can have phone calls at the door. It's, it's, it's a mess. During the day, it's a mess. So you need to basically try to schedule your deep work when nobody is around, when everybody is doing other shit, right? So this is another block of deep focused work where I'm going to focus on major main features, stuff that needs to get done, but I'm giving myself the slippage of minor tasks. You know what I mean? It's like deep focused work, but if there is something I need to handle that is minor, interact with the community or something, I'm going to do that. 
that's something I'm never going to do in the morning. But at, this, at the second block, maybe I'm going to make an exception and do it because the majority of my focused work is already been done in the morning, right? That's basically my day. And then after that, I'm going to do a little stretch uh, because I'm getting old. I'm going to do stretch and then I'm going to uh, sleep, right? And if I sleep, I watch Twitch. Uh, I watch some garbage videos. So basically, uh, not garbage, but basically these, these, these brain dead videos. So I can be, because my brain is full of stuff. And if I watch these videos like Asmund Gold or something, it's always nice. There's always something nice to say. Asmund Gold or something else. Uh, I'm going to watch that so I can fall, I can relax and fall asleep. And the morning, when the morning comes again, rinse and fucking repeat. That's what it is. Right. So there's also no excuse for you to say, yeah, but uh, I'm, I, I want to be in shape, but I have no time. Complete garbage. Complete. I, my life is so fucking busy and I fix that. Because if, if we basically check how many hours I work in total, it's going to be seven to eight hours. It's, but the trick of this is to schedule your focused work where, when you are the most productive. That's, that's the key trick. And you need to force that. I understand that sometimes you cannot force it because you work at a company, you need to be there and you need to be physically uh, there in the space. But that's going to cock block you as a productive human. So you need to find a way to basically force that schedule, something like this. It is what it is. I'm so sorry. A lot of, yeah. I, can, I cannot not think to say, say more about it because you need to force this schedule in your life. So uh, let's talk a little bit more about eating, right? So I have these two hours here. I have two hours to go to the gym and cook food. Hey, perfectly fine. There's no need for me to go to fast food because I have no time. I have time enough. And if you spend two hours in the gym, you're doing it wrong. You're doing it fucking wrong. You need to spend one hour in the gym. Again, the same thing in the gym. You're going to do the same thing. You're going to focus. You know what I mean? You're going to do your compound exercise in the beginning. Your deep focused compound exercise, your heavy work. You're going to do it in the beginning. You're not going to sit on your cell phone. You're not going to talk to, to these other pepegas in the gym. No. You're going to focus for one hour. And you're going to do your exercises. And you're going to do your exercise perfectly fine. That's what you're going to do. One hour to gym and one hour to eat. Perfectly fine. Right? The same thing in the evening. No need for fast food. Kids from school, I have fucking three hours. I have three hours to do all that stuff, to cook food, to do homework with these guys, to do, to do whatever. You know what I mean? I have time enough. Very important. Food, health, very important, guys. Just saying that. Uh, there, is, there is no secret trick. The only secret trick I can sh that, that I can say you is schedule these, these, these blocks of deep focus whenever you, you're the most focused. That's the, that's the secret. That's the secret sauce. That's the secret sauce, guys, right? Um, and be consistent. It's very important. It's not today. It's basically the whole fucking year you're going to do that, right? The whole fucking year. Because the results of the seeds you plant today are not going to get, how do you say that, harvested tomorrow, right? You're going to harvest these, these things over years. Don't be, don't, don't fall into the trap of instant gratification. Don't do that. Uh, yeah, I can swear to God, try this. I can swear, I can guarantee you, if you try this for one year, if you give yourself the, the if you, life is so normal, you're going to live a long, fucking, a very long time. So give yourself a year to do this and check the results. Yeah. And you need to protect it. That's very important. If somebody calls me and says, Anthony, can you do a meeting tomorrow morning? It's important. No. We can do that at, at in the afternoon. I, 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 yeah, I can maybe reschedule some some gym stuff, or I can, I, I, yeah, maybe here in this block, I can, I can, I can. There is some space to move, right? Or maybe here at in this block. But I will never sacrifice my high productivity block in the first three four hours in the morning. Never, ever, ever. Very important. All right. I hope this is going to answer a lot of your questions. This is how I do things. Is this the key to success for you? I don't know. This is was one for me. Well, is the key to success. It's something that works for me. 
Um, so, and if something is, don't change the winning team, this is working, I'm not going to change it. There is, of course, some room to, to change here and there, and not, there could be exceptions, of course, if somebody has an accent or something, of course, right? Life is, is, is nasty. But the majority of your years or days or months, you're going to, I'm going to, I'm going to have this schedule at all fucking times, and I'm going to protect it with my life, right? Uh, if you have more questions, don't hesitate. Tell me what you think about this. Tell me how you schedule your day. Uh, tell me what where your pain points are. Happy to help out. And uh, like I said, if you like this video, uh, subscribe to the channel. Give me a thumbs up. Leave some questions in the comments. Jump into my Discord community. Maybe we can talk a little bit more about that. Check out my Patreon. And I'm looking forward to see you in the next video or live stream. Bye-bye.